Well, people think that, that we're sort of crazy people. We're not crazy people at all. I mean, the crazy head is a part, it's a character, which I put on, and I put it on in public, um, to get people to stop coming to me with their problems. Now, for years and years and years, I've been sorting other people's problems. I've made a lot of people a lot of money. I've made myself nothing. But that's not the point. It's taken me a lifetime to prove to people that someone can actually do something for nothing without wanting anything in return. Because people always think there's something beyond that. There's nothing beyond it at all. So, rather than solving everybody's problems because I had enough on anyway, I created the crazy head, which works. So when people come up and say, how would I have got this? What? What problem? Oh, God. Yes, well, tell me about it. I don't know... Um, I don't know whether I can help or not, but uh, I can have a go. Do you mind if I just take a pill? Because I could have, could have a pill. Love. Can I just pass me one of the pills? Oh yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't give me no alcohol. No, I'm to take no alcohol. No. Yes. What? What's the problem? If you could hurry up though, because I'm I'm due back in Rampton for midnight, and 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 you know what they're like there. It's, it's a really violent place, and I've got to be back there. So what's your problem? And they just turn around and say, Oh, well, it don't matter. We're sorry to bother you. I would like, you know. And they just go away and people just don't bother me anymore now with the problems, you know what I mean? I mean, it's, it, it's crazy. I set fire to people. I do the Mahatma Gandhi illusion. Live. No illusions, no Paul Daniels. Paul Daniels is not a very good magician. He's all right. But if you were looking at Paul Daniels and if you could associate, like if you could put it into, like, if Paul Daniels was a singer, then Ali Bongo is a composer, if you can relate to that. There's far better magicians than Paul. It's just that nobody gets a chance. And like British TV, and there's nobody about that will spend money on illusions. I mean, the greatest people in the world. I mean, who's, who can you think of who was, who was great? There was Alexandra, the great. He was great. He was. And then there was um, Alfred. Well, after he burnt the cakes, he set up a family business in Edinburgh, you know, and he went bust in 81. But it was a family concert. And um, that's just the way it goes, like. But if anybody needs any help out there, just don't come to me. Just send the letters care of Rampton. And I made to bed, in fact, like, well, I'm, I don't know. I don't know whether I'll, I'll make it through. The doctor says don't book no holidays. I don't know. And I'm out on the road tonight. I've got uh, Angie. Oh, by the way, Angie just had uh, a, a baby premature. So we're spending a lot of time over at Jimmy's, you know. We've got this big do at Roundy Park as well on the 29th. A big outside do. I'm going to do a big illusion there. Right. I'm going to make a snooker table disappear with Joe Johnson and Tony Knowles on it. In full view of everybody. But nobody will take any interest. Because I'm one of these people who, like, I'll be wanted. And people will appreciate what I do and what I have done in the past. And there's quite a few of us about, like Keith and Ian, and a lot more people I can mention. But they'll want us when we're like Jackie Wilson or Sam Cooke. You know, that's when they'll want us. But it'll be too late then, because we'll be gone. You know. But I could do with some sleep. My God, I could do with some sleep. I don't know how I'm going to get through the show. I feel like Mike from Flair, <laughs> permanently, <laughs> just depressed. You know, he goes through 14 antidepressant tablets in the first hour of waking up. Did you know that? You know, I mean, I, I just don't know. I, I just don't know how he gets through. I mean, I don't think he's uh, he's gone to Germany now. I mean, he's gone into partnership with somebody in Germany. He's sending me over to Germany. I don't know whether I'll like it or not. I'm just having two days there to start with. He says that'll probably be enough for me.